right, y'all. So I'm about to head. I done made it back from the game, man. If y'all ain't checked that video out, make sure y'all go check it out. But right now, I'm about to head to a downtown locker room and pick up a side seven that I hit for in the UNC Toe Jordan Ones. I already picked up my pair. I couldn't vlog it because my man's store, he was doing inventory and stuff. So he didn't want to store the, you know, all the boxes and stuff. But we are going to unbox those at the nest. Get an up close and personal look. And we about to go vlog and pick up this other size I got. Man, I had a long day today, y'all. But it's definitely about to wind down. I hope y'all had a nice, safe day, man. I ain't really been, you know, I ain't really just been feeling the vibes lately, man. But your boy trying to. You know, overcoming, man. I've been feeling like it's been a little cloud over top of your boy here, but it be like that sometimes, y'all. But we gotta keep pushing, man, because life don't wait for nobody. Let's go. Y'all, so we made it to the downtown locker room. Right here, man. So, get ready. Uh, grab these sneakers, your boy here for inside. Nice little pink shorts right there, man. But I don't even think I need no extra shit, man. I got a lot of UNC blue, so I ain't really got. See, look, this that bullshit that Joe and Brian be doing, y'all. They give us the UNC toe highs, but then they make some lows, bro. That's why the shoes be sitting, bro. Why would y'all drop? Two of the same shoes, a low and a high. I didn't even know that we was getting UNC toe lows. Look at these Jones, man. What the heckery? Then they gave us the Jones with the Jordan sign, man. Why they give us the Nike Air on these? What y'all think these gonna do, man? 110 for the UNC toe low. But they look just like the highs. Why would they do that, man? This is crazy. That's why the shoes be sitting. Them ain't gonna sell because the, one, the highs gonna sell. You know what I mean? But that's what they fuck up by Jordan Brian. Crazy as hell. That's what Jordan should have never sold to Brian the Nike. Should have kept that shit. My bad, bro. But yeah, over here in the kids section, they still got the lucky green ones, right? Twos, y'all. Twos right here. Still got these sitting as well. The low light been going crazy though, man. I don't need, I ain't know what these are. I ain't know these at least right here. They got these right here, these cool. The women's exclusive reflective joints right there. Them joints cool, man. I might grab those one day. This not today. We here for something else today, man. They got some cool 2002 odds right here, man. Some different type material, but them lows is crazy, man. It, I ain't know they was making some um UNC toe lows, man. And then they brung them out right around the time of the highs. Why they just didn't keep the lows for later on or release the lows first and then release the highs? Like, they did the same thing with the Lucky Green Jordan ones, man. They brung out some highs, then they brung out some lows. Next, we're going to get some mids. I think it was some mids over there. I don't think that was UNC Blue, though, man. Is, those, is that UNC Blue, too? Bro, I, I, I ain't even look at these, y'all. Bro, they gave us the UNC mids, too, bro. They, they going crazy. They going crazy, bro. The University Blue mids. They just don't got the toe. They ain't the UNC toe, but they gave us the UNC mids, the UNC lows, and the UNC UNC low toes, and the UNC uh, UNC Jordan one high UNC toe. Why would they do that, bro? Like, why would they do that? That's dumb. I guess if people can't afford the high, they can get the lows. They can't. They don't want the lows. They can get the mids, but. That's still got like backwards, bro. Like, I don't know, but yeah. They did a raffle for preschool and toddler shoes, bro. So that means somebody wanna get a shoe for their baby, you gotta put in a raffle and win, bro. That's crazy. I mean, I guess they trying to keep people from buying them all up, but a lot of the times it don't be hard to get your uh, toddler shoe, bro. Imagine, imagine putting in a raffle for a shoe this small, bro. You can't hit. <laughs> You don't even hit to get your little baby a shoe, bro. Like, this shoe stuff is starting to get crazy, bro. It's getting out of hand. But, dang, they got the perfect shorts for the kids, for the UNCs, man. Some perfect shorts right here. Perfect colorway and everything, man. It's a nice little shirt right here. Little UNC blue drum. I'm a little colorblind. I might gotta put this right up against the shoe. I don't know. But your boy, my camera light blinking, bro. We gotta hurry up. Let's see, man. Look, that's crazy. I can put them up against the lows just to see, man. Uh, it's a little different. It's a little different, man. It ain't. It's, it's a little lighter. It could be a little darker to, to match that joint, but I don't think I got to buy no shirts. Yeah, I got endless UNC blue. I got so much light blue in the house, it don't make no sense. I need to stop buying light blue. But knowing me, I might still do it, man. I might still do it. 
might still find me a shirt. Just not today. Just not today, man. But they do got some. Oh, unless they got some steals and deals in here. Oh, hey, get a little. Uh, hey, get a little Stillum rack right here. On fourteen dollars and up rackery. Right here, man. But yeah, y'all, we gotta hurry up with this camera thing. Cause my camera about to die, y'all. Hey, man. Uh. I don't know, I don't see no, like, you don't see blue in none of these shirts right here, man. Uh, but yeah, man, I definitely just grabbed that size 7 for my daughter, y'all. Oh, these, this shirt right here might do, man. Mm -hmm. I think this is the same blue, man. I'm a little colorblind. This is the same blue? Oh. Nah, is it? Uh, nah, it's a little too light, y'all. I've been wanting this little shirt right here for a minute, man. This shirt right here, y'all. Hey, man, we're going to finish this vlog when I get outside my camera about to die. Mission complete. I got my daughter uh, size 7, and I also picked my little brother up a pair of shoes. I grabbed him the playoff 13s because he's young, you know. He wears size 4. He's going to need something all black that's leather. No uh, suede or nothing, so he won't dog him out. And it's still the summertime, so it ain't like he's going to just wear them to school and take them off. So we got we grabbed him some playoff 13s, which I think was a good grab. We got them on sale, too, as well. We're going to run back and unbox these junks, get a close up, close and personal look at them. Y'all know how I do, man. We're going to check him out. Even though I did do an unboxing of a grade school pair, but we're going to unbox a men pair. I'm going to give y'all my opinions. Hopefully, I did get a good pair. I haven't checked them out yet. Hopefully, I don't have no bad quality control on mine, but yeah. Back to the nest we go, y'all. Let's get it. Welcome back to the nest, y'all. Let's get this review out the way. But yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed already. Get this video a like, man. I ain't even got my like button lit, lit up, man. I think, oh, I might have burnt the batteries out of it already, man. I might have left it running. But yeah, y'all see it, man. Get this video a thumbs up. Anyway, we got the UNC Toe Jordan ones right here. I did already do a review on this specific shoe right here, but it was a grade school size, so we got a men's size right here. So we're gonna go ahead and get it out the way and get out of here, but let's go, y'all. We're gonna start off with this box. Of course, we got the all over UNC blue, or like I said, man, it looked more like a powder blue to me, but now we're just gonna go with what the name was. So we got the UNC blue box right here with the black Nike signs going all throughout the box. But y'all know I'm be tripping off the box. The box label reads Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Colorway University Blue Black White. This is a USA size 11. This is a personal for me. And what is crazy is, man, I didn't hit on no raffles for these joints, bro. I didn't hit on no raffles. I missed the, uh, the sneakers I dropped. Like, I was loafing. I was loafing. I almost didn't secure me a pair, but, you know, shout out to City Beast, man. He let me uh, send on the money, and he put them up for me, and I sent somebody to pick them up for me, man. But that's that. Flipping open the box lid, you do got uh, the, uh, that code right there, or the numbers right there in the inside of the box. Right there, written in red. That's that with the box lid. So yeah, bringing down the paper, man. We got the Air Jordan 1 UNC Blue right here. The box label does not say UNC Toe. That's just what people named them. So you might hear me say it throughout this video, but for real, I, I like to just call them the UNC Blue Jordan 1s. But I see why they call it the UNC Toe because you do got the OG University Blue Jordan 1s right here. So you can't really call them the same thing so i get it i get it so i guess we're gonna do that but yeah let's get this box out of here man these are right, man these are right. hey I, the only reason why my reaction is different is because i've seen so many early pairs and i know it's plenty of people that probably watch plenty of videos of these but we're gonna do it anyway you got the the uh university blue right here on the back of the shoe and coming around you got that white right there on the side panel with the black Nike sign right there of course you got the white midsole you got the university blue on the toe right there that's why they call them the UNC toe boom got the white on the front and the black on the front of the toe box you also have the UNC blue bottom right there as well so that's kind of 
the color blocking. It's like a black toe color blocking. It's still a clean shoe, man. It's still a clean shoe. Let me see, man. I do got some slight glue on the back of this pair right here, man. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's like some, some slight glue on the back of my shoe back there. But I ain't really tripping off of that. I can take some goof off and wipe that off if I was tripping. But other than that, man, I feel like Jordan Brand, they did, they did a good job with these as far as quality. The leather right there on the front of that toe box, so that UNC toe right there, is, is very soft, very plush. So they did give us some good leather on this pair right here. I can't complain. In the inside, we do have this spare pair of uh, University Blue Laces that come in this little cardboard right here. The grade school pair didn't come with actual laces. I don't know why. I feel like they, they just always do something when it comes to grade school. They even get an all black plain box. You know what I mean? They don't get the same color box that the uh, men's pair get. Or they get our box and they don't get extra laces. Like, they always just, they got to let you know that your feet is small. Like, they got to remind you that you are in grade school. But in the inside, we do have shoe paper, not a shoe tree. You got that uh, Nike Air in the inside, written in UNC blue. Right there, right there, right there. So... That's that with that shoe. Same for the other shoe, man. Shoe paper, not a shoe tree. And it's crazy, man, that this is, I feel like early pairs kind of spoil you a lot of stuff sometimes, bro. Even when it comes to making content. Because it's like, I'm not even really excited to be doing this unboxing and showing y'all this shoe because we done seen it so much. Like, so many people had early pairs and... They was hyping them up so much, and this, 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 that, UNC told this, UNC told that. They done shock drop, exclusive access, uh, sneaker pass. They did so much when it came to this shoe. It's like, even creating the content is just like, uh, okay, they right here. You know what I'm saying? But just like any other shoe, bro, eventually the hype will die down. They, they release now. They release today was finally the release day, depending on when you're watching this video. It is Saturday, late Saturday, about to be Sunday. But yeah, it is Saturday. They did release today on the 22nd. So, with that being said, just watch how the hype just die down. It'll die down. People gonna stop talking about them because, I mean, that's what happened with shoes, man. It's really, it's really just like, man, on to the next. We got the UNC toes. Now the black toe low is supposed to drop in August. Uh, the UNC2 Chicago Jordan 1 Lowe's. Bro, matter of fact, I definitely wanted to speak on this. Did y'all pay attention to the video when I was in the downtown locker room, bro? Do y'all see what Jordan Brand be doing? They released the Air Jordan 1 High right here, the UNC toe. Then they gave us some UNC Blue Mids, and they gave us some UNC Toe Ones that look just like this, the Lowe's. Some UNC toe low ones, man. If y'all paid attention to the video, bro, that's crazy. I don't understand why would they do that? Why would y'all bring these out, bring some mids out the same color, and bring some lows out the same color? I mean, I'm guessing it's because if people didn't get this shoe, they can go get the lows or the mids. Or if people don't like highs, they can get the mids. Or if they don't like highs or mids, they can get the lows. Like, I, I don't know if that's how they doing it, but they did the same thing with the with the Lucky Green Air Jordan ones as well. The Lucky Green Air Jordan ones dropped, then they dropped some mids in the Lucky Green colorway, and they dropped some lows in the Lucky Green colorway. But the lows that look like this, bro, they look just like the spot on same color. All they did was just cut the top off, bro. They, they pretty much just dropped the top on these and made them some lows. And it's crazy because... I kind of like the lows better, bro. Like I, I, I've been, I've been liking my Jordan One lows lately, man. I don't know why. I got this pair right here, so I got the powder blue lows right here. But they look like this, but they gave them that UNC toe. If you watched the video, if you didn't see it, make sure you rewind back. If you skip through it or whatever the case may be, make sure you rewind back to when your boy was in that downtown locker room. They had UNC. Uh, the 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 men's didn't have the toe. The men's they had a toe, they had like a bread color blocker. So they had the UNC, uh, UNC Jordan 1 Miz, and they had the UNC toe Jordan 1 Lows, bro. It's crazy, it's crazy. But, hey, man, I got I to gotta speak up and speak out. 
now that I actually got these two in hand, the men's pair, uh, because I told y'all we had like a big fight with these. Was this blue like a powder blue or UNC blue? Um, I don't know. I feel like the shadow is messing with my eyes right now, man. Okay, so okay, so the Jordan One High, it, it is a little lighter. It is a little lighter. Y'all let me know. What's y'all opinion? Is the Jordan 1 uh, University Blue 1s, are they lighter than these powder blues? I think I can see it now. But now on camera, I think I think everybody can see. But it's it's still close, bro. Like, it's close. I don't know. I don't know. It's close to my eye, man. But like I said, I'm slightly colorblind. These two colors is what I would see the same. I would see these two colors the same. I wouldn't see no different in them. Yeah, y'all let me know, man. It, it's just, it's just, it's too close to me. It's too close to me, but it is what it is, man. I'm used to this type of UNC blue, man. Like, like, like this. I'm used to this type of you. Down went my lava lamp, y'all. But yeah. Anyway, I'm used to this type of UNC blue right here. Do y'all see this? How light, how light this one is? The OG pen compared to the pen that just released right here. It's, it's, it's a big difference. It's a big difference. But that can be because it's suede. But even on the bottom, bro. Like, even with, even with my uh, OG pairs being worn, bro. Even on the bottom, it just it just looked different to me, man. It looked different, man. It, it looks like the OG pair just, it's just lighter. I don't know, man. I don't know. I might be tripping. It is what it is. It, it, it's still blue, man. My favorite color is still blue. But yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see what let's see what about the laces, man. So uh mm, they about the same. The laces, I don't, I feel like they can't get the laces wrong. But like I said, it can be because one pair is suede or nupa and one of them is leather, so the color will probably, you know, be different on this shoe. So it is what it is, man. It's still a clean shoe. Y'all let me know in the comment section below were you able to secure a pair? I wanna I wanna say that's kind of a, a dumb question, but at the same time it's not because I almost slept on my pair. And I heard I was watching a couple people lives, man, and it was some people that was taking L's, man, that didn't that didn't um secure a pair from the sneakers app. But a lot of different stores had them, like Nordstrom's had them. Uh, Dick Sporting Goods had them, uh, DTLR, Foot Locker, like they they was everywhere, bro. If you put your feet work in, they was not hard to cop. But I ain't gonna lie, I haven't hit y'all with an on foot video in a while. But make sure y'all stay tuned for the on foot and the lace swap of these joints right here, man. The only reason why I haven't hit y'all with a uh, on foot in a while is because I haven't really had no no on foot shoes. The last on foot I hit y'all with was. Was these right here, I believe. The Jordan 1 High Wash Blacks. This was the last on foot I hit y'all with. And after those, it was just like, ah, everything that came out wasn't really worth uh, uh, on foot look to me. Like, I think we ended up getting, we got them, uh, them, um, we got the uh, elephant print joints, the highs and the lows, I believe. And then uh, the court purple LeBron's, bronze, I caught those. And the red phone posits, I feel like uh, it wasn't really, you know, no on foot look worthy. With these right here, I can throw a couple different laces in these, man. I could do the blue laces that came with them. I could do some white laces, some red laces. I can go crazy. I can go crazy with these right here. So I feel like these are definitely worth an on foot look with a lace swap so make sure y'all stay tuned for that i'll be getting that out to y'all first thing this week tomorrow sunday hold your boy to it man by tuesday wednesday morning i will have that on foot of the unc toe jordan one highs right here man but i just slid my chair out y'all i do that every time <laughs> but Y'all let me know y'all thoughts and opinions on this shoe right here. Were you able to cop? Were you able to secure a pair? Did you want them? Did you pass on them? I feel like a lot of people that passed on them, they might be end up trying to double back, man. And if you a reseller, my opinion, hold or sell, I say if you got them today, man, sell them by tomorrow, sell them by uh, Monday, 
don't hold on to these. They they not gonna go up in value, bro. They, I mean, they they not these, bro. They 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 not these, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? They not these. They they was just they was too mass produced. So when that happened, it brings down the value of the shoe because it's not really it's a high demand, but them demands are being met because it's so many pairs. So hey, man, if you got them, get rid of them. As best as you can for the best price that you can before the price drop back down or they do a, a weird crazy restock. But yeah, thoughts and opinions on these on this pair right here. Did you get a pair? Did you want it? Did you pass? It don't matter how you feel about it. First of all, how y'all feel about the UNC Toe Jordan ones? I'ma be honest, I like them. It's a 10 out of 10. Favorite color blue, good color blocking, material is good. Jordan ones can't go wrong, but at the same time. Bro, I'm glad that they here, bro. I'm glad that they finally came. The release date is finally here, so we can stop talking about these sneakers, man. And that's gonna do it for today's video, you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed the content, the unboxing, and everything else that we did, man. Shout out to my young boy for his birthday, man, and all that. But yeah, hug your loved ones. Let us know you love you guys. And always, always, always remain solid. With the Air Joy 1 USC Toe, baby. Come on.